Hey everyone, I wanted to do a real quick editing video. This is only going to take a few minutes because my method is pretty simple. So I do most of my editing inside Scrivener. As I generate prose, I will bring it in over here to the left wherever it's needed and simply copy it in. So whenever I am ready to start editing, let me find a nice lengthy one here. Okay. So when I'm ready to start editing, first I do one pass that's real general. And I do it one of two ways. It doesn't really matter. It's just kind of how I'm feeling. Either I will go through and just start deleting all the stuff I don't like. And I have a little section over here that I keep all my deleted stuff so I don't permanently lose it. Or I'll go through and do the opposite with highlighting. So I might say, okay, I like this. So I'll highlight it, read through, and just keep going like that and highlighting certain things I like. So that is my first path, either deleting the chunks or making highlight or doing highlights for these sections that I do like. My second pass, so if I didn't like this, let's just remove it for right now. So my second path would have a lot of breaks. It wouldn't be near as long. And what I would do then is have a new document and I would start combining everything. Let's say I put this in there. And then I went through all those sections I had highlighted and start taking those that I like and trying to put those in the chronological order. Let me put this back because I have not started editing this one yet. What I like editing in Scrivener is, of course, I can do the color highlights and I can also do my kit bashing side by side. Let me do another one. So I can have these two documents right here. And let's say I did the same thing because these are for both for chapter one. So same scenes. And again, I would do the same thing and go through and highlight everything that I liked. And then do the new doc to where I'm mixing and matching everything. So that would be the second pass. First pass is, again, highlighting what I like or deleting what I don't like. Second pass is starting to mix and match. Third pass is when I'm really sitting down to read it, start editing everything, all the wording to make it mine and doing any transition scenes and stuff I need. And at that point is also when I go into pseudo write proper. If I need a transition scene or if I need to extend something, change some wordings up and I don't have a vision for it in my head, I'll go into pseudo write proper with that part and start using the laser tools. And then of course, once I think I have everything in place, I do my final read through to see if there are any other issues that I need to uh, cover. And that is pretty much it for editing. So edit everything in Scrivener, take it into Sudorite proper as I need and do my final read through, very easy. If you don't have Scrivener, Obviously, you could do this in any other document, uh, Word doc, Google doc, or even Sudorite proper. I know plenty of people just use Sudorite for all of that. So there you go. I just take mine in steps, and hopefully that helps you decide how you want to tackle your editing. Bye, everyone.